One of the most frequently asked questions um, we have from patients is, what sort of type of injection would be best for me, steroid or hyaluronic acid? And it's easy to see why there is potential for confusion around this, because obviously both of these injections can be used to treat pain, and both of these injections are used to treat osteoarthritis, for example, wear and tear. So the types of um, differential that we will oftentimes say to patients, if you have pain and inflammation or swelling, you may be best to consider a steroid injection. The reason being that steroid is a very, very potent anti-inflammatory. So if there is an element of swelling and inflammation, steroid is very likely to give you a reduction in your pain symptoms. Hyaluronic acid, you may want to think of more like an oil change to the joints. So it helps with cushioning. It helps to make the tissues around the joint more flexible. And so it's not so much an out and out painkiller per se, but it improves the environment within the joint, improves the flexibility of the tissue. It's very common nowadays to have an injection which includes both the steroid and the hyaluronic acid. And this can be done either at the same time, at the same appointment, or you can separate these two injections. Normally someone would have the steroid injection first and then potentially come back a few weeks later and have the hyaluronic acid. And again, I would say one of the main determinants of how we would do that is the level of inflammation and swelling in the joint. That's certainly the, one of the main criteria that I will always advise patients on. So if there's a lot of swelling and inflammation, you might wanna have the steroid injection first to calm the joint down, and then a few weeks later have the hyaluronic acid. There's not too much swelling and inflammation you can by all means have both injected at the same time.